program, giving inmates at the Muskegon County Correctional Facility the opportunity to get a college degree. It is through the Hope Western Prison Education Program. News 8's Brittany Flowers introduced us to this program in July. You may remember, but it now has a creditor approval. Brittany, what does this mean? Yeah, Donovan, the approval, which comes from the Higher Learning Commission, officially allows the Muskegon Correctional Facility to serve as an additional location for Hope College to offer instruction. It also recognizes inmates as part of the student body. They're starting off with a cohort of 12 inmates and will continue to recruit an additional 20 each year until they reach full enrollment at 80 students. Inmates will be taught by Hope College professors and after four years, they'll earn a bachelor's degree called Faith, Leadership, and Service. This degree was designed specifically for men at the prison, and it's actually not available to students on the main campus. We hope that they experience a degree of personal transformation. Uh, but beyond that, we hope that uh, their growth and maturity and education will be put to use in trying to uh, soften and improve the prison culture of which they're a part. The program is funded by donors, so it won't cost anything for inmates. And Dr. Ray says similar programs have led to major reductions in misconduct incidents, fewer instances of parolees returning to prison after they're released, and increases in post-release employment. Live in studio, Brittany Flowers, News 8. All right, good stuff. Brittany, thank you.